What's up? It's Dustin Conrad, Bands and Body Fitness, Old Thailand Resistance Training, coming at you with some breathing techniques. But before we jump into that, I really want to talk about the importance of breath um, as a fitness component and also as a mental, physical uh, embodiment that you can live your life by. Um, so breath work in general has revolutionized my life, not just like making me feel like I breathe better and feel more confident, but also dislodging a lot of stuck emotions and excavating a lot of toxic whatever, oxygen, CO2, bad stuff out of the body. Um, these, we're gonna just walk through four breathing techniques and they're really designed to excavate stale oxygen out of the body, pump in fresh oxygen, get your blood circulating better, um, deepen your daily breath, like by stretching out your respiratory system, like literally we're gonna strengthen your respiratory system. And then the third part is uh, start to autonomize your daily breath. So you have more of an automatic rhythm of breath rather than a shallow, uh, panicky, um, you know, dysfunctional breath pattern. Um, there was one more thing I wanted to say about breathing and that is that uh, uh, your breath, if you're breathing from a panicked, shallow state, it's telling your body and your nervous system that you are stressed or in tension and uh, in fight or flight mode, and that's contributing to cortisol. So for, from a stress, from a, a, a fat loss standpoint, it's so crucial to learn how to breathe better and center yourself. From a mental and, and a mind-body relationship standpoint, um, there is all sorts of emotions that get stuck in your body and can be channeled through your breath. I promise you, like, people cry, people laugh, people um, release, have revelations, insights. So I really invite you to really hone in on your breathing techniques and practice them every single day, a uh, minimum of five minutes, and it will change your life, it'll change your body. All right, so we're gonna walk through it. So uh, the first breathing technique we're gonna do is the breath of fire. This is really to pump out stale oxygen, excavate all that bad stuff out of your body. And basically all it is is an exhale. Usually it's done through the nose, but you can do it through the mouth as well. You're pumping your belly. You're exhaling, pulling in. So basically each time is a And you don't worry about the inhale. That'll just naturally happen as a reflex. So it would be like this. You can even place your hands on your belly and it would be like this. Literally I'm contracting and pulling in my belly button. Done, be done through the nose like this. I was hesitant to do that because I didn't want snot to get all over you because it is kind of chilly out here in Santa Monica, sunny Santa Monica. The second breathing technique I want to show you is the two-part breath. This is all done through the chest and the intention is to autonomize the breath. I call it the circle of breath because you're really creating a natural rhythmic bouncing back reflex of the inhale turning into the exhale. It's a pushing and pulling natural uh, uh, automatic process. So basically this one's all for the chest. You can place both hands on your chest. It's an open jaw. The wider the jaw the better and it will look like this. You basically want to feel the top of the breath and not force it. You want to release control. Find where the top is and just let it naturally turn into your exhale. So you inhale. Find the top of your exhale. Find the top of your inhale. And it really helps you to familiarize with your range of motion with your breath. Third breathing technique, this is the three-part breath. You see kind of the progression of one, two, two, three, four, we're going to do the next one. So the three-part breath is going to be one through the belly, one through the chest, and then exhale through the mouth. This is kind of your traditional rebirthing breathing technique that you'll find at most breathwork classes. Very transformative. And this one really is geared to help stretch out the respiratory system, stretch out the diaphragm, deepen your capacity for breath. So inhale through the belly, inhale through the chest, and then just a complete releasing exhale, like a sigh almost. It would look like this. Our last one that I want to show you, this is the four part breath. Um, this one is really designed to pump oxygen into your body. Uh, it's a great one to do first actually because it really gets your uh, respiratory system fired up, it's oxygenating in the bloodstream and uh, in, in the brain as well. And then, you know, it's a really, really good one to kind of fire up and get started in that one. So this one's uh, all done through the belly and it's four parts through the belly, inhale, four parts through the belly, exhale, it will look like this. And 
all these breathing techniques I'm showing you in a pretty fast tempo, but can be done at any tempo. And I recommend starting off fast and then, you know, halfway through or more towards the, third, the, the final quarter, I'd recommend slowing it down. So an example of that would be like this. And there you go. Five minutes a day, guys. No less and more is welcome.